the South Jersey News Channel. This is News Channel 40, NBC at 6. A public-private partnership between a solar energy company and the city of Vineland will generate much more than power for area residents. The goal is to create some powerful and affordable rates for utility customers. Nichelle Polston has more. Since I became mayor in July of 2008, we have lowered our rates two times. And the city of Vineland continues to stabilize their electricity rates, making the most out of the power from these 11,000 solar panels. We will lead the nation by a factor of 10. Uh, and we already lead the nation by a factor of 10. As this mega solar system feeds power to the Vineland Municipal Electric Utility, is expected to save area residents a nice amount of money. We're approximately 25% cheaper than Atlantic City Electric, our rate, so our citizens are, 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 are benefiting and our residents. And officials with Violence Utility Company explain what makes the cheaper rates possible. The cost is highest when the sun is shining. And so solar makes a lot of sense for us because as the sun shines, it reduces our load and provides less exposure to high cost uh, spot energy. Meanwhile, officials with NFI Solar, the company in charge of putting this system together, tell us this project isn't completed just yet. In fact, crews are set to add more panels, producing even more savings for the area. In the field in front of us is phase two of this project. It's another megawatt. So when this is done, it'll total three megawatts DC. According to the mayor, the city has three more solar projects on their agenda, which will only help Violin grow into a greener and stronger city in the near future. In Violin, Michelle Polston, News Channel 40, NBC. According to the statistics from the Solar Electric Power Association, Vineland is leading the state in green power and is among the top three in the nation. 